Hey everyone, it's Mike again with a new video today. We are going to be replacing the rear brake pads on a 2006 Beard LaCrosse. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to jack this thing up. Make sure you have it in a secure spot. Go up with it. You ain't gotta bring it up too high, just enough to get the tire off. All right, that'd be good right here. First, get a flat tip screwdriver and knock this cap off. All the way around without damaging it. All right. Now for this one, you're gonna need a, um, a 14 millimeter in the ratchet. Get an impact and knock this tire off with the 19 millimeter. Yep, 19. Like so, pull the tire off, set on the ground. All right, back here we got two bolts, one at the top and one at the bottom. And that will be a 14 millimeter. Uh, So, do the same thing for the next one down there. I'm gonna get these pads off. Just like that. Alright. Now that they loose, you can start taking them off with your hand. Put the bolts to the side. Make sure you inspect these as well when you're taking them off. Up and off. Move the cover to the side. Your brake pads. Get them. Take them off. They through. They are worn to the ground. All right. New brake pads. Brake best. And make sure they're the same. So what you could do is lay them down. And see that? The indicator on this side. Make sure you get the same one and match it up so you won't get confused. Same one. See? Just like that. But I'm going to keep this to the side right now. What I'm going to do is set this to the side and I'm going to clean it off with some brake cleaner. Same with this one. Bring this one down and match it. Make sure they're the same. All right, that's the same. So what I'm gonna do is I got some brake cleaner from AutoZone. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray it down very good. All in the back. All righty, that should be enough. I'm gonna try to really inhale this because you know it's too strong and everything just like that and make sure you inspect these make sure these push in and push out very smoothly just like that and uh now that I drive it going to install the brakes down like that up and in make sure you get them in the corners like so same thing with the next one. 
and clap them in just like that. Now the next one is we're going to do is get the special tool so we can push that piston back into his place. So open the box. Try to see if I get a smaller one to match up with it. Let's see. That might work. Put the camera down for a minute. What I'm doing is getting a pattern that fit that you see them with the two notches at right there and right there you put you just you just actually pop one in just like that line them up and they just go in and you just put it on here and you just turn turn that's all Put the camera down again. All I'm doing is twisting it, see? Twisting it. Twisting them grooves. That's all I'm doing, see? Twisting. But that piston can go back in this place. That's all I'm doing. But the tool, special tool you need for the rear brake pads on some cars and all. Let's twist it as far as you can get it. A little more. Just make sure. Let's push it in. Here. It really come with more, but I just do it this way. It go in just, just fine. Just put it on. Get the right one that fit on it. Push it in the best way you could. It's almost in. A little more. All right. See, slide right on. Now you can do is put your bolts back where you got them from. Same thing with the lower part. Get your ratchet. Snug it out best way you could. Not over tighten it. It'd be a little slugged. Same thing with the bag. Get it nice and snug. Ah, just like that. What you want to do now? We get let's call the tie back on. So 
Put your boats, your lugs, I meant. Boats, same thing. Halfway. One more somewhere. There we go. Like so. Alright, get your center cap, line it back up, pop it on like so. Alright, that's how you change rib pads on a 2006 Buick LaCrosse. Thanks for watching.